Assalamu alaikum everyone this is me Ramsha Sultan and today I am going to use a thing which I've never used before and that is a beauty blender yes you're right I have never used it before this is the original beauty blender which the beauty industry has been raving for years now I have always preferred my trusty fingers to blend the foundation so today I am going to do a competition on half of my face I use this beauty blender to blend the foundation and on half of my face I use my trusty fingers to blend the foundation and let's see who wins whether I was right all this while or the beauty industry let's begin so the method told to use the beauty blender is to dip it in water for a while and it shall increase in size I have never done it myself let's squish it in water I hope you can see it and I am making sure that it's fully dipped oh my god it's increasing in size oh god it increased so much can can you see the size it increased so much I actually have never done this before so I'm very excited and let's wring out the water very nicely uh, okay so it has definitely increased in size and the next step is to actually wipe it a little bit so I'm using a handkerchief to wipe it very very nicely so now the beauty blender is ready to use it has increased in size oh god it's so exciting so now I will be using the Maybelline fit me foundation to apply on my face and let's begin so I what should I do should I take it directly on the beauty blender and blend it or okay I'll dot it on my face and then blend it because that would use less of the product I have seen videos where they say that it is a better method so yes let me dot this foundation on uh, this side of my face so now I'm gonna use this product I am so excited I do not know why so let's blend it and I have to use it in dabbing motions, right? Oh God! So it definitely does blend really well. I'm actually surprised. It's it's very very soft on the face. Otherwise, if you use brushes, they're quite harsh. But it. It's actually wet so it's also like a cold therapy on the face. Oh wow yeah, I've never expected something like this. I actually like it so far. Oh wow, um, can you see it? It blended. Uh, very well I was not expecting it because I've used um, foundation brushes and kabuki brushes before but uh, this looks really really natural and I thought that I'll have to do this procedure for really long keep bouncing it on my face but it was pretty quick I'm actually quite happy nice yaar I actually like it so far so let's do another coat if possible I'm gonna try one more coat of foundation So let's use it again. Guys, I'm actually really happy with the result. I have used makeup sponges before like from the color bar for blending but I've never used a beauty blender that to the original one. There are many fakes out there but uh, the original one is really nice. It's so squishy and it is so soft on the face. I am so happy and as I told it also feels a little wet and nice. It's 
I actually enjoyed it. I never expected that I would be so happy with this product. And on the other side of the face, I'll be using my fingers to blend the foundation. So let's do that. Let's use the fingers. So I'll be blending the second coat of the foundation. I don't believe I'm saying this but I actually enjoyed the beauty blender procedure more compared to my fingers. I've been using my fingers to blend the foundation all these years and I don't know why I didn't switch to it because I really like the procedure of the beauty blender. Also I want to say that definitely the fingers give more coverage because there is no product absorption while on the beauty blender a lot of product is absorbed so a beauty blender gives you a natural coverage of the foundation it takes away the excess product but with the fingers all the product is on your face and is clinging somewhere or the other for example on the sides of the nose there is a little patchiness and the foundation actually shows and Yes, there is a difference in the coverage. Definitely the finger gives high coverage compared to the beauty blender. But it looks more natural with the beauty blender. And I actually like the procedure. So it's time for the winner and definitely it is the beauty blender. I do not believe that I'm saying this because I initially thought that I'll do a competition and then I'll say that, see I told you, you really don't need this product. but. Oh my god, I actually liked it and I feel that I'll be using it much more in coming future and I'm glad that the beauty industry came up with this tool to blend the foundation and other products. Definitely Beauty Blender is the best way to apply the foundation. And that's it for the video guys. I really hope that you enjoyed this type of video. I have honestly never tried the beauty blender before this video and it is 100% genuine reaction. So if you enjoyed it, comment down below so that I can do more such experiments and definitely share it with your friends and family and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.